Okay, this is going to be a real quickie on the 76.22 automatic transmission shift mechanism. Um, one of you guys was calling in and asking about uh, why it wouldn't shift from drive to fourth. Um, I've never pulled one of these apart before. So I decided you know, it was a good time. So I went to the wreckers and grabbed one and it was stuck. I made sure I found one that was stuck and would not go into uh, fourth gear. There was a bunch of them that did uh, shift down from drive to fourth, third, second, first, whatever. I made sure to find one that wouldn't. Um, brought that one home. I pulled it apart. I haven't put it back together again. Looks like it's going to be a real pain to put back together. If you've got this problem that's not shifting from drive to fourth, don't pull it apart. Don't. That's not your problem. That's your problem. The arm that goes down and connects to the transmission there's a pin and slider on here. These get corroded. And when you leverage the gear shifter back and forth, I'm not going to be able to do this very well, but when you pull the gear shifter to the right, when you pull the gear shifter to the right to make it go down into the lower gears, it levers this entire thing over and allows it to move up and down in this channel. But it needs to be able to move, sorry, it needs to be able to move back and forth on the shaft. That's the entire problem between not shifting between drive and fourth, third, second, first. That's it. There's no other problem in there. Even if this whole cage is full of rust, um, you should spray it in there and get uh, lube in there anyway. Do not pull the whole thing apart. It's not fun to put back together. Um, one of the guys, I can't remember your name at the moment. Sorry, I'm just making this uh, video right now. Um, I know you're having, you, you were asking last night. You had a bear of a time putting this back together. I can see why. I haven't done it yet, but uh, I'm going to play with it and put it back together in a second. But before I lost all the light, I just wanted to show you this is the problem. This will slide in and out as the, as the, as the shifter moves back and forth. This needs to slide. It's not supposed to be pressed on there. It's not supposed to be stuck on there. It will just spray some lubricant on both sides. And basically, um, I tapped it with a... With with a, a little hammer, a small bodywork hammer, I tapped it on the bottom in and out and you'll eventually get that moving Then grease this up and you'll be good to go. It will go back over into fourth and then shift down all the gears. Um, how to put it together, I haven't, like I said, it looks like a bit of a bitch once you pull everything apart because there's a bunch of parts you have to hold together and put back together all at once. Not worrying about that now because I'm telling you don't take the transmission shift module apart. You don't need to. All you need to do is lube this shaft on the top. You can see it from inside, um, from underneath the transmission body. You can see this this from in uh, from up underneath. So lube that. Yeah, there is. Sorry, I'm trying to hold these two pieces together. You'll see on the bottom where this, uh, the bottom of the shifter rides up and down inside this channel here, and you think to yourself, well, how the heck is it moved back and forth? Because it it pushes on the side. Well, it pushes and leverages the entire gear shift lever over and if this pin isn't sliding it won't it won't pull over to the uh, to shift into draw into fourth. So anyway, lube that sucker up and that's about all I can think of. Don't pull it apart. You don't want to.